Jonas has the call. For the 2015 running of the Sky Bet Chase over three miles, the most prestigious jump race of the season at Doncaster, and Mr. Moonshine is the first to begin. Fairy Wrath towards the outside, Renard is also prominent, and they've gone off very hard here in the early stages. If in doubt, Grandad's Horse and Royal Player are the three who want nothing of this early scramble around the turn, and they are the last trio, as now they face up to the first of the 18 fencers. No prisoners taken. Fairy Wrath and Mr. Moonshine battle for the early lead, followed by Vino Griego and Renard on the inside. Godsmead Judge together with Buck Mulligan, as all 14 are safely across fence number one on towards the second which is the open ditch Mr. Moonshine in the centre, Fairy Wrath on the outside, Renard in third, a bad mistake by Vino Griego, and down is Yes Tom. Yes Tom in the rear third of the field has unseated Brian Harding at the open ditch fence number two. So Yes Tom is out of the race, detached is Royal Player right at the back of the field and a heavy restraint from Richard Johnson as they go over the cross fence, that was the third, and they're all safely over. So it is Fairy Wrath around the outside who just has the lead the dark blue colors the royal blue on the inside mr moonshine in second the yellow silks of renard in third buck mulligan in fourth and knighty milan creeping a little closer now in fifth as they go with the first in the home straight followed then by vino griego and then lost legend on the inside of god's me judge and stable mate meda me next on the inside bailey's concerto granddad's horse if in doubt ridden with restraint and hampered by the loose horse and on the inside is royal player they go over another Plain fence in the home straight, a slight mistake by if in doubt towards the outside, but not a serious one. And now they come on towards fence number six. And it's Fairy Wrath and Will Kennedy who now cross over towards the far side rail with Mr. Moonshine and Buck Mulligan towards their outside, hampered by the loose horse, a mistake by Vino Griego, his second error of the race, as they come on now towards the fence, which were the last in a circuit's time. This time it's fence number seven in the Sky Bet Chase, and Fairy Wrath will just have the lead and they're all safely over again slow at the back of the field was if in doubt so they have a circuit to go in the 2015 running of the sky bet chase and it is fairy wrath who leads now being pestered by the loose horse mr moonshine is in second Knighty milan is in third buck mulligan to the outside racing in fourth renard is in fifth godsmith judge in sixth seventh is vino griego and eighth around the outside is the gray medami ninth on the inside bailey's concerto in tenth is lost legend and then in eleventh towards the inside royal player together with if in doubt and granddad's horse still at the back of the field so they go now towards halfway and on now towards the water jump and fairy wrath once again just pestered by the loose horse over the water they're all safely over granddad's horse is still at the back of the field of 13 who remain in the sky bet chase over another plain one and given a broadside by the loose horse fairy wrath and so too mr moonshine who was hampered there as they go on now towards an open ditch fairy wrath with buck mulligan to towards the outside with the noseband. Knighty Milan and Mr. Moonshine, then the yellow of Renard. Godsme Judge is now being pushed along, followed by stablemate Medami. Vino Griego, another one who's just been niggled along, as if in doubt in the green and gold hoops, makes ground towards the outside of Lost Legend. Bailey's Concerto now drifts back in the field. Grandad's Horse and Royal Player still are the last two. They rise now up Rose Hill, going now towards the 11th. They completed a circuit. Fairy Wrath and Buck Mulligan the first. First two, Renard was slow. Also slow there was Vino Griego. Over Rose Hill they go. They now have another seven fences to take in the Sky Bet Chase. It's Fairy Wrath who leads Buck Mulligan in second. Mr. Moonshine to the outside in third. The old boy Medemi's getting close to the grey in fourth. Knighty Milan to the inside. The white colours is now in fifth place. Renard coming under the pump. Followed next by Belius Concerto. Now Royal Player spot the dark blue with the light blue checkered sleeves creeping into contention now for Richard John. Johnson, a cosy ride so far as they go now towards the seventh from home. Mr. Moonshine and Fairy Wrath on the inside. A slight error by If in Doubt, who just drifts back a couple of places. Around the turn and on towards the final open ditch, fence number 13. And Fairy Wrath will have the lead. He paddled his way through it, but he led there by a length and a half. They're all safely over. Godsme Judge and Grandad's Horse and Vino Griego are still out the back of the field. So on towards the cross fence. This will be the fifth from home. Fairy Wrath. 
Gareth leads. Mr. Moonshine, Nighty Milan, the white colours towards the outside with If in Doubt, Buck Mulligan and Medami, Lost Legend, Bailey's Concerto, now coming under a ride is Royal Player, God's Me Judge, Renard has dropped out of it, so too as Vino Griego and Grandad's horse has never been at the races. They're making the turn in, four to take now in the Skybet chase, and it is now Night in Milan, who takes the lead over in second, Fairy Wrath. If in doubt, jumped into third place. A shuddering error at the back of the field by Mr. Moonshine, who was beaten at the time. But it's now Knight in Milan, followed by If in doubt. These are now the first two. Then back in third, Fairy Wrath. Then Bailey's Concerto, followed by Buck Mulligan, Medami, Lost Legend, and then Renard. They race down towards the second from home. And here comes If in doubt. And he swings on the bit to come and take the lead, battling on Knight in Milan towards the inside. Here's the second from home. The novice, if in doubt, on the inside. Last year's Grimthorpe winner, Nighty Milan, now staying on. Bailey's Concerto towards the outside. It's these three now who battle down towards the 18th and final fence. If in doubt, will rise in front. Bailey's Concerto a peck on landing, but he's now come alongside if in doubt. If in doubt, the far side, finding more for AP McCoy. Back in second now, Bailey's Concerto, but it is if in doubt. There can be no doubt. The win winner of the Skybet chase is, if in doubt, who wins for AP McCoy. Bayless Concerto in second and Nighty Milan in third. Renard re-rallied for fourth, followed by Lost Legend, Medami and Buck Mulligan.